Well, shit the bed. No, what are we drinking now? Thirsty goat. Thanks, customer. Um, got home from work today. I got to ride the other fellow's grom. It was really nice. It was stinking fun as hell. That sucker's exhaust is awesome. Brakes on a grom are tons better. Uh, in particular, the front brake. Uh, it was a different ride. Um, get home and I grab this handlebar trying to move it forward just a little bit more and son of a bitch if the kickstand didn't move up so what happens the fucking Kawasaki bounces a couple times and lands on its side the damage is that lever right there that's it not a big freaking deal actually it helps out uh, doing wheelies and shit oh, I didn't look at the shifter lever let's see what we got down here oh god damn it it's crooked oh well I'll just take a wrench and clean it up It'll straighten right out. Put a piece of gum on it. We'll be good to go. So the Kawasaki Z125 Pro bounces well. Does great. Not much damage. No big sweat. So I've got a beer opener. Yay. So I'm going to try to install some stuff I got in. Uh, I was intending... Uh, I was hoping I was getting my Fender Eliminator. Fender Eliminator today. Uh, that didn't happen. But I did get my stinking blinkers for the front, so I will install those and we'll see how they go. Hasta. About to get to work, but I gotta have some business first. God bless America. All right, kids. The objective of today's exercise is to get rid of some of this fucking wonky Shrek ears here. They would tell me that didn't look like fucking Shrek right there. Blam. And when you're driving down the road, these motherfuckers just. So we're getting rid of these some bitches. Uh, I ordered my flush mount LEDs from TST. So this is the uh, plug and play wiring harness that they supply. That's that. All right, I'll put that right there. Um, fortunately, I was able to gank some resistors from work. So that'll be helpful too. In addition, these are the LEDs which will flush mount right there. How Fucking cool is that? All right, so I'll be putting those on and uh, making this thing not be such a jackass anymore. And you know that'll cut down in the aero. Oh, I'm just gonna put that right there. That'll cut down in the aerodynamic drag. Additionally, it will reduce the weight. Uh, you know, just it'll it'll help with the awesomeness of it. So wish me luck and more beer. Holy fuck me, Alex, man. So I've been ripping out my Chinese abacus. Oh, look at your flashlight. And all kind of other shit. Trying to figure out how to disassemble this whole front assembly. Look at that. Anyway, no luck. So I threw the screwdriver down, whipped out the Allen key. If you look, oh, look under Shrek's fucking ear right here. In that little hole right up, oh, right up in there. So right there, there's gonna be an Allen screw what not shit where am i yeah an allen screw oh look at that you can see right down the hole because it's not there anyway that's where it would be and there's one equally on the other side under shrek's other fucking ear you just rip those bad bitches off watch this this whole fucking head opens up look at that now we're gonna work on it let's do this so the face is open what time is it Time for a fucking success beer. Oh, come on, baby. Come on out of there. Oh, yeah. Cheers. All right, so this is a blank rate based on straight wiring it up. It's annoying as I'll be damned. So we're gonna jab a resistor on there and see what the hell happens. Let's see how this goes, bitches. All right. All right, here's a blink rate based on the resistor being installed. That is more acceptable than it was. Hang on, I jab it. Oh, 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 that's blinding. Oh, yeah. The pain. Anyway, so that's just jabbing a resistor in, in line. Um, so I got these at work. I sure would love to know what value those are. I may rip one apart so you can uh, grab one at an electronic store or something like that. Anyway, sure slows these guys down. That's what you want. You want it nice, smooth, blank. 
And holy heck, those suckers are bright. Don't look at them. Dude, don't do that. That's fucked up. Anyway, yeah, it works much better. Oh, and my dash uh, blinker works. So the reason I'm doing the resistor is because if you use, ah, oh, hell, if you use uh, the relay that you can get from any, shit anywhere to replace the relay that's in there, your blinky blinky on the dash will not work. So that's not acceptable for the tone, so we got some awesome lights. So if you're looking at the Shrek here, it's really simple to remove. You remove that one screw uh, right down there, and uh, you pop off the top, you pull out the backing plate, and rip that some bitch off. It's really simple. Fucking Shrek here. All right, guys, we're gonna take an intermission. I'm gonna cut this fucking resistor open. I wanna find out the value of it. It's just a big freaking resistor, no big deal. And it's probably gonna have a, a double connection point. No big deal. So, but what I would like to do is cut it open and find out the value. So if you need to run down to your electronics store, you can just grab this damn resistor pack. It's just a big fat ceramic resistor. Can you see it in there? Yeah, look at that. It's just a resistor, not a big deal. It's a high heat, big friggin' thing. I bet you can get this for remote control cars. But I would, oh shit, dude, I am stupid. I'll tell you what, I'll just measure the resistance. Hold on, hold up, hold up, hold up. That's another beer's worth. Hold up. Yeah, I ain't cutting shit. So this is a 10 ohm resistor. There you go. This little bad boy is 10 ohms. That's all there is to it. Nothing that special. There's no magic behind it. It's a 10 ohm resistor. That's it. And you got uh, the red. They're nice enough to give you a goes into and a goes out of. And the, that's the positive side. And then you got your negative goes into, goes out of. So it's basically putting it in line. So bada bing, bada boom, you got an inline resistor of 10 ohms. Thank you very much. Please drive through. I didn't cut it open. All right, so it's all buttoned up. Uh, all I need to do is put his head back on. Blinkers are working fine. I mean, look at that. That's beautiful. Looks like I can get on the road minus the uh, beer drinking. Oh, beer drinking. Okay, thanks. So I think I earned another beer on this one. Since I got here, let me blink for you. Bada bing. There, we'll blink. Look at that. Blink and drink all at the same time. Life's good. Oh, shit. Danger World Robinson. So this crap works fine. Blinkers, astounding. TST Industries, you rock the house. Golden, works great. Who's your daddy? It's all good. Man, this is, life is good. Uh, issue I do have is, did I bend my bars when I dropped this son of a bitch? I know I fucked up my uh, lever. And, well, hang on. I fucked up my shifter. I fucked up my lever. Did the bars mess up? I kind of feel they're kind of cattywampus. Uh, someday, when I'm not drinking, I should give this a test drive. Uh, I don't know. It might be fun drinking and doing it, but uh, no, no, no. Let's do this all legal like. But I got blinkers, motherfucker. Look at that. TSC Industries. So, full review of the TSC Industries. I went to the website. I saw that they had this for the Kawasaki Z125 Pro. I ordered them. I knew I needed resistors because if you order their flash relay, you don't get your duty whacker, their uh, dash thing, even though I can see it right there. But anyway, you don't get that. I want it. So I, ordered, I wanted resistors. I had resistors. I got them. Used them. They're 10 ohms, by the way. Uh, big friggin' ceramic 10 ohms. Uh, they sent me shipment notification, which was baller. I loved that. Uh, they also sent me a tracking number. I could track this damn thing. I knew it was at my house before I even got home. So I want to thank you, TSD Industries. That is really superb service. Thank you very much. And I love the fitment of the, of the uh, flush mount LEDs. Uh, they function exactly the way I wanted them to. They look great. Uh, thank you very much.
I appreciate the good work and I appreciate the tracking number and I appreciate you shipping it promptly. Thank you.